Sedina? Also, the screens uh, had already blocked somebody's card. Are we exposing somebody? Yeah, you're done. Hey. Amen. <laughs> Gracious our Lord, thine kingdom and power, glory forever, man. I'm so is Marin <laughs> Kempai eo so apfai, nim neo tiron tebenon, kenheri niven jevivan do krator pshois benoti. Pro se vexaste, Eliana, I vip shois venoti pipan to krator. If you tim ben shois, o penoti, o pen so tir iso. O Zbi Christus, we thank you for everything concerning everything and in everything. For you have covered us, helped us, 
Gonna do not accept us, your sales, spurred us, supported us, and they brought us to this hour. Pray that God may have mercy and compassion on us, hear us, help us, and accept the supplications and prayers of his saints, for that which is good on our behalf at all times, and forgive us our sins. Lord have mercy. Therefore, we ask and entreat your goodness, the love of mankind, grant us to complete this holy day and all the days of our life in all peace with your fear. All evil temptations are set in the counsel of victim and the rising up of enemies hidden in the manifest. Take them away from us and from all your people and from this holy church, and from this your holy place. But those things which are good and profitable do provide for us, for it is have given us the authority to read in serpent and the scorpion, and upon all the power of the enemy. <laughs> to Christ, or the Father of our Lord God and Savior Jesus Christ, 
who has contributed goodness, O lover of man, kind remember, O Lord, the sick among your people. Pray for our fathers, or men who are sick with any sickness, whether in this place or in any place, that Christ our God may grant us with them health and healing and free of us our sin. Lord of have visited them with mercy and compassion, heal them, take away from them and from us all sickness and all maladies. The spirit of sickness chase away, those who have long lain in sickness raise up and comfort. Those who are afflicted by unclean spirits set them all, all free. Those who are in prisons or dungeons, those who are in exile or captivity or those who are held in bitter bondage. O Lord, set them all free and have mercy upon them. For you are he who loosens the bound, uplifts the fallen, the hope of those who have no hope, and the help of those who have no helper, the comfort of the faint-hearted, the harbor of those in the storm. All souls that are distressed or bound, grant them mercy, O Lord, grant them rest, grant them refreshment, grant them grace, grant them help. Grant them salvation, grant them the forgiveness of their sins and their iniquities. As for us too, O Lord, the maladies of our souls heal and those of our bodies cure. We use the true physician of our souls and our bodies, the bishop of all flesh, visit us with your salvation. Lord of شكرًا <تصفيق> Upon your holy, rational altar, and ever a sweet savor of incense before your greatness and heavens through the service of your holy angels and archangels. As you have received the gifts of the righteous, able to sacrifice for our father Abraham to my of the widows who also receive the thanks offerings of your servants, those in abundance, those in scarcity, hidden or manifest. Those who desire to offer to you but have none, and those who have offered this gift to you this very day, give them the incorruptible instead of the corruptible, the heavenly instead of the earthly, the eternal and ten, instead of the temporal, their houses, their souls, fill them with every good thing. Surround them, Lord, by the power of your holy angel and archangels, as they have remembered your holy name on earth, remember them also, Lord, in your kingdom. And in this age to leave them not behind. Lord have mercy. Let us praise with the angels saying, Glory to God in the highest, peace on earth and goodwill toward men. We praise you, we bless you, we serve you, we worship you, we confess to you, we glorify you, we give thanks to you for your great glory. O Lord, King of heaven, God the Father, the Pontocrator, O Lord, the one and only begotten Son, Jesus Christ, and the Holy Spirit. O Lord God, Lamb of God, Son of the Father, who takes away the sin of the world, have mercy on us. O you who takes away the sin of the world, receive our prayers unto you, who sit to the reign of his Father, have mercy on us. You only are the Holy, you only are the Most High, my Lord Jesus Christ, with the Holy Spirit. Glory be to God, the Father, amen. Every day I will bless you and praise your holy name forever and the ages of ages, amen. When I see that my soul awakes early unto you, O oh my God, for your precepts are light upon the earth. I was meditating on your ways, for your help unto me. In the morning you shall hear my voice, for I stand before you, and you shall see me. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, the one of the virgin, have mercy upon us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, who is crucified for us, have mercy upon us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, who rose from the dead and ascended to the heavens, have mercy upon us. Glory to the Father and Son and the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto the age of the ages. Amen. Holy Trinity, have mercy on us. Holy Trinity, have mercy on us. Holy Trinity, have mercy on us. O Lord, forgive us our sins. O Lord, forgive us our iniquities. O Lord, forgive us our trespasses. O Lord, for the sake of your people, heal them for the sake of your holy name. Our Father and brother, not fallen asleep, O Lord, repose our souls. O you are a thousand, Lord, have mercy on us. O you are a thousand, Lord, help us receive our supplications. For you the glory, dominion, and holiness. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, bless us, amen. 
Our art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses. We forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, deliver us from evil one in Christ. Jesus our Lord, for thine the kingdom, power, and glory forever. Amen. 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 As the Lord and our behalf, they have mercy on our soul to forgive us our sins. He parthenos mariam, tita otokos, et the web, he prostitutes, and not in our behalf, for Christ, we were the even kindness to get us of our sins. Share in it, parthenos, he A pure turtle, the who declared in our land and brought to us the fruit of the Spirit. Be ebnet man barakli, don't be it, a be agent, be shit, agent, and me on to be ordained, he's got up tables and no end. That the has announced to us the peace of God for mankind. And the way out in hell beats its wrong, be shall in no end, they are in the end, be nine, and are right, are of ten, ten, and she. Jesus, the begun of the Father, he was born of you for us, setting free our race. Our heart, mar, and tau, O Fedwot, and Ben Hate, and Truck, Men, and Soson, and Ben Kelas, and Oshed, Bull, and Goemus. O our Lord Jesus Christ, make for yourself within us a temple of your Holy Spirit, glorifying you. Share in your tea, partner, so remain a little in it. Share the Trojan tip and girls are echo, not a man who is. We ask you to remember us, O our faithful life, but give me for our Lord Jesus Christ, thy name. Marcus be apostolos, who be evangelistis, be metrikani and cup and tebi monogris and noti. You have power to light in us through your gospel and taught the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. A cantinable ten at Kakir, one at Bioin, Minak Mona Boykinter, one at the Epsipal ten at Ben. All the tribes of the earth were blessed through you and your words at Rizzi and of the world. Share in Akubi Martiro, share be evangelistis, share be. Apostolos, Marcus be the Oremos. Praise the Lord on our behalf of all of God the Evangelists. Mark the Apostle, that he may forgive us our sins. Nipestos and Martyros, the Tapai Hani, the Ogmos, the Vampiran, the Christos, the Rebecca, and the Shiri. While they were praying, the Lord's angel appeared to them. They rejoiced and he announced to them their martyrdom. After you know, he parked on Taniki, after I turned with Moe, and Pathot and Trust and Needle, and I've hinted on Pekrom and Pomo. And as he said, they sent the devil to the Lord of the Lords, and another God, they rejected their offering. They were crucified as them. They beheaded the children of the Lord of the Lord, and they had the believers, but the six for them, their miracles of fear. Praise the Lord that our we have, all beloved of Christ the King, Rebecca and her children, that you forgave us our sins. Show me in the Lord something, and can you make us see that we can keep to us, choice to the rent to the auto, go to the impertinence and say, you you have borne our good Savior to take away our troubles and grant us his peace. Share in hell, the partner of Sorem, in anything, share the Trojan tip and can sorry for not in man who is. We ask you to remember us, O our faithful advocate, before our Lord Jesus Christ, that he may forgive us our sins. We exalt you, the mother of the true light. We glorify you, Saint of the cause, for our Lord, the blessed Savior of the world, that he came and saved our souls. Lord, be to our master, our King, Christ, the Father, the Apostle, the Son of the Lord. Joy with the righteous remnants of the church, church against the against us sins. We proclaim the holy trinity, one Godhead. We worship him and glorify him. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord bless the men. We believe in one God, and God the Father, but one throughout the Lord, creator of heaven and earth, and all things seen and unseen. We believe in one Lord, Jesus Christ, the only begotten Son of God, begotten of the Father, before all ages, light of light, true God of true God, begotten, not created, who is the Father, by whom all things are made, who for us, man, for our salvation, came down from heaven, was incarnate of the Holy Spirit, the Virgin Mary, became man. 
Have you crucified, rest of the Pontius Pilate, son of Mary's bearing, a third day rose from the dead? According to the scriptures, he ascended to the heavens, he says, I'm the reign of his father, he is coming again, his glory, judgment, being the dead, whose kingdom shall have no end. He has to believe in the Holy Spirit, the Lord, giver of life, who proceeds from the Father, the Father, and the Son, who is and glorified, who is one without prophets, and one holy Catholic, and apostle of the church, who even has some pipes on the mission of sin. Ten gorge, ten gorge, ten Our God, who sent to sainted disciples and honored apostles, may prophets, righteous people have desired to see the things which you see and have not seen them, and to hear the things which you hear and have not heard them. But as for you, blessed are your eyes, for they see, and your ears, for they hear. May we be worthy to hear and act according to your holy gospel through the prayer. Of you are saints. Pray for the Holy Gospel. Lord have mercy. Remember also our Master, all those who have bidden us to remember them in our prayers and supplication which we offer up unto you. O Lord our God. Those who have already fallen asleep, repose them. Those who are sick, heal them. For you are the life of us all, the salvation of us all, the hope of us all, the healing of us all, and the resurrection of us all. Salmos to David, Alleluia. Nick Naib Sho is Tina Hose, Emo Usha, Ene is Jingo, Usha go, Tina go and take meth me, Hen Roy, Jagos, Je Una, if a concha, Ene, Ene Rich and Nifi, Owe is not softy, and Je take meth me a little yam, so Tim Tashiri on a ring, be maj, Ari, a option belaus name of Eter Fente, be yot. J api oro ere bithim en ebe soi J o we en thof be be chois Alleluia Stasi te me tavovo athio a koso mi en to agio evangelio. Es mara ot in jevis ni o chen evram sheste ni gon kiria flogison. Ek to kata markun agio evangelio en tu anar nos mars. Fear of 
God and listen to the Holy Gospel, the Gospel according to St. Mark, may his blessing be with us all, Amen. A psalm of our father David the prophet, may his blessing be with us all, Amen. I will sing of the mercies of the Lord forever. With my mouth I will make known your faithfulness to all generation. For I have said, mercy shall be built up forever. Your faithfulness you shall establish in the very heavens. Alleluia. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord, our Lord God and Savior, King of us all, Jesus Christ, Son of the living God, to whom is glory forever. Amen. Very early in the morning on the first day of the week, they came to the tomb when the sun had risen. And they said among themselves, Who will roll away the stone from the door of the tomb for us? But when they looked up, they saw that the stone had been rolled away, for it was very large. And entering the tomb, they saw a young man clothed in a long white robe, sitting on the right side, and they were alarmed. But he said to them, Do not be alarmed. You seek Jesus of Nazareth, who was crucified, he is risen, he is not here. See the place where they laid him. But go tell his disciples and Peter that he is gone before you into Galilee. There you will see him, as he said to you. So they went out quickly and fled from the tomb, for they trembled and were amazed. And they said nothing to anyone, for they were afraid. Glory be to God for Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done. Christ, the Lord Jesus Christ, the only begotten Son and Lord, is the Father who has broken every bond of our sin through his saving, loving, and suffering. Breathe in the face of his holy disciples and saintly apostles and said to them, Receive the Holy Spirit, whose sins you admit are remitted to them, and those you retain shall be retained. You also now, our Master, have given grace to those who work in the priesthood and the Holy Church to forgive sin upon earth and bind loose every bond of our iniquity. We ask and treat you, goodness of love of mankind, for your servants, my fathers, my brethren, my weak self. Those who bow their heads before your holy glory dispense unto us your mercy and lose every bond of our sins. If we have committed any sins against you, knowingly or unknowingly, through anguish of heart or in deed or in word or from faint heartedness, to a master who knows the weakness of men as a good and lover of mankind, grant us the forgiveness of our sins. Bless us, purify us, make us absolve, all your people absolve. Fill us with your fear, straighten us into your holy goodwill. You are our God, and the glory, honor, and dominion, and the adoration are due to you, together with good Father and the Holy Spirit, the love giver, who is one essence with you now and at all the times and unto the age of all ages. Amen. Amen. Minnan lilla jag tog sig vet rike, jag kan jag ge
المسيح إلهنا كريست is our Lord بخريستوس بنوتي Christ our Lord, the King of peace, grant us your peace, establish for us your peace, and forgive us our sins, and hear us, O Lord, when we pray to thankfully saying, Our Father who art in heaven. Hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, on earth as it is in heaven. Forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. In Christ Jesus our Lord. Thanks. If
سينان بشوي سينان أمين اللي لو يأخن فران مفيوت نمبشيري نببنا ما يثواب ونوتنا تأمين ذك سبب تريك أيو كي أجبنا ما تكنين كأي كسوس أنصن أمين prayer and praises of the third hour of this blessed day offered to Christ my God and my King beseeching Him to forgive my sins from Psalms our Father David the Prophet may His holy blessings be with us all Amen. أمين الليل يا خن فران إم فيوت نم بشيري نم بأبن ما إثواب ونوتن وتأمين زك سبب تري كأي أو كأجبن ماتي كنين كأي كأستوس أنصن أمين prayer and praises of the sixth hour of this blessed day of the Christ my God and my King beseeching him to forgive my sins from Psalms our Father David the Prophet may his holy blessings be with us all Amen Zuxasi, Othi, Othi, Mon, Holy, 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 the Holy Gospel according to Saint John, may his holy blessings be with us all. Amen. When the comfort of the Holy Spirit, when the Father, the Holy Son of my name has come, he shall teach you all things and bring to remembrance all things that I have said unto you. My peace I leave with you, my peace I give unto you. Not as the world gives, do I give unto you. Let not your heart be troubled, neither let it be afraid. You have heard how I said unto you, I go away and come again unto you. If you loved me, you would rejoice, because I said I go unto the Father, for my Father is greater than I. And I have told you before it comes to pass, that when it comes to pass, you might believe. I will not talk much with you, for the Prince of this world comes and has nothing in me. But that the world may know that I love the Father, and as the Father gave me commitment, so I do. Arise, let us go from here. I am the true vine, and my Father is the vine dresser. Every branch in me that does not bear fruit, he takes away. And every branch that bears fruit, he prunes, that it may bring forth more fruit. Now you clean through the word which I have spoken unto you, abide in me, and I in you. Glory be to God forever. Amen. May the saying of God be fulfilled in peace. We worship you, Christ, our God, with your good Father and the Holy Spirit. For you have risen and saved us. Have mercy upon us. Your Holy Spirit, O Lord, whom you sent forth upon your holy disciples and honored apostles in the third hour, do not take away from us, O good one, but renew him within us, creating me a clean heart, O God, and renew a right spirit within me, do not cast me away from your presence, and do not take your Holy Spirit away from me. O Lord, who send down your Holy Spirit upon your holy disciples and your honored apostles in the third hour, do not take him away from us, O good one, but we ask you to renew him within us, O Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, the Word, a right and love-giving spirit, a spirit of prophecy and chastity, a spirit of wholeness, righteousness, and authority. O oh, the Almighty One, for you are the light of our souls. O oh, you who give light to every man that comes in the world, have mercy on us. O oh, Theotokos, you are the true vine who bore the cluster of life. We ask you, full of grace with the apostles, for the salvation of our souls. Blessed is the Lord our God, blessed is the Lord day by day. He prepares our way for his God of our salvation. Amen. O heavenly 
seeking the comfort of the spirit of truth who is present in our places and fills all the treasure of good things in life giver graciously come and dwell in us purify us of all defilement O good one and save our souls just as you are with your disciples O Savior and gave them peace graciously come also and be with us grant us your peace save us and deliver our souls Whenever we stand in your holy sanctuary, we consider it as those standing in heaven. O Mother of God, you are the gate of heaven. Open for us the gate of mercy. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, who was born of the Virgin, have mercy upon us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, who was crucified for us, have mercy upon us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy mortal, who rose from the dead and sent into heaven, have mercy upon us. Glory to the Father, and Son, and the Holy Spirit, now and ever to the age of Amen. O Holy Trinity, have mercy on us. Holy Trinity, have mercy on us. Holy Trinity, have mercy on us. O Lord, forgive us our sins. O Lord, forgive us our iniquities. O Lord, forgive us our trespasses. O Lord, visit the sake of our people. Heal them the sake of our holy name. Our fathers and brothers have fallen asleep. O Lord, repose their souls. We are without sin. Lord, have mercy on us. We are without sin. Lord, have mercy on us. glory, diminish your holiness. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, bless the men. Who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. For I, Jesus, our Lord, for thine is kingdom, power, and the glory forever. Amen. Hail to you, we ask you, sin full of glory. The ever virgin, the ever close mother of Christ, lift up our prayers unto your beloved Son, that he may forgive us our sins. Hail to the Holy Virgin, as brought forth unto us the true light, Christ our God. Ask the Lord on our behalf that he may mercy in our souls and forgive us our sins. O Virgin Mary, the Holy Theotokos, the faithful advocate for all mankind, intercede on our behalf before Christ, whom he bore, that he may grant the forgiveness of our sins. Hail to you, O Virgin, the right true Queen. Hail to the part of our race of our blessed Emmanuel. We ask you to remember us for our faithful advocate before our Lord Jesus Christ, that he may forgive us our sins. Zuxas, O Theos, Yemon, Holy, 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 the Holy Gospel according to Saint Matthew, may his holy blessings be with us all. Amen. And seeing the multitudes, he went up on the mountain, and when he was seated, his disciples came to him. And he opened his mouth and taught them, saying, Blessed are the poor in spirit, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are those who mourn, for they shall be comforted. Blessed are the meek, for they shall inherit the earth. Blessed are those who hunger and thirst for righteousness, for they shall be filled. Blessed are the merciful, for they shall obtain mercy. Blessed are the pure in heart, for they shall see God. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called sons of God. Blessed are those who are persecuted for righteousness' sake, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are you when they revile you and persecute you and say all kinds of evil against you falsely for my sake. Rejoice and be exceedingly glad, for great is your reward in heaven. For so they persecuted the prophets who were before you. You are the salt of the earth, but if the salt loses its flavor, how shall it be seasoned? It is then good for nothing but to be thrown out and trampled underfoot by men. You are the light of a world, a city that is set on the hill cannot be hidden. Nor do they light a lamp and put it under a basket, but on a lamp stand it gives light to all who are in the house. Let your light so shine before men that they may see your good works and glorify your fathers in heaven. And glory be to God forever. Amen. May the sins of God be fulfilled in peace. We worship you, O Christ, with your good Father and the Holy Spirit. For you have risen and saved us. Have mercy on us, you on the sixth day and the sixth hour. We are nailed to the cross for the sin which our father Adam dared to commit in paradise to the handwriting of our sins. O Christ our God, and save us. I cried to God, and the Lord heard me. O God, hear my prayer, and do not refuse my petition. Be attentive to me, and hear me in the evening, in the morning, and at midday. I say my words, and hear is my voice, and delivers my soul in peace. O Jesus Christ our God, who are nailed to the cross in the sixth hour, and killed sin by the tree, and by your death you made alive the dead man, and created with your own hands, and died in sin, but that, that our pains by healing, like giving passions, and by the nails of which you are nailed, rescue our minds from thoughtlessness of the earthly deeds and worldly lusts, to the remembrance of your heavenly commandments according to your compassion. <laughs> Since we have no favor nor excuse nor justification because of our many sins, we through you implore to him who was born of you, O Theotokos the Virgin, for abundant and acceptable is your intercession with our Savior. O holy mother, do not exclude us sinners from your intercession with whom you were born. For he is merciful and able to save us because he suffered for us to deliver us. Let your compassion, Spirit, reach us for exceedingly humbled. Help us, O God, our Savior, for the glory of your name, O Lord. Deliver us and forgive us our sins for the sake of your holy name. You wrote some vision in the midst of the old earth. O Christ our God, as you stretch your holy hands on the cross, therefore nations cry out, saying, Glory be to you, Lord. We worship your incorruptible person, O good one, asking the for the forgiveness of our sins, O Christ our God. 
for of your will you were pleased to be lifted up unto the cross to deliver those whom you create from the bondage of the enemy we cry out unto you and give thanks to you for you have filled all the with joy o savior when you came to help the world glory to you <laughs> She who is full of grace, O Theotoko, the Virgin, we praise you, for through the cross of your Son, hate fell down, and this was a bullish we were dead, but we are heroes and became worthy of eternal life, and gained the delight of the first paradise. Therefore, we thankfully glorify the Lord Christ our God. We exalt you, the Mother of true light. We glorify you, Saint Theotoko, for you have brought forth unto us the Savior of the whole world. He came and saved our souls. Glory be to our Master, our King, Christ, the Pride of the Apostles, the Crown of the Martyr, the Glory of the Righteous, the Promise of the Churches, the forgiveness of sins. We proclaim the Holy Trinity, one Godhead. We worship Him, we glorify Him. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord bless us, Amen. We believe in one God, God the Father, the Pontic Creator, Creator of heaven and earth, and all things seen and unseen. We believe in one Lord, Jesus Christ, the only begotten Son of God. We are the Father for all ages, life, life, true God, true God, true God, 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 not created, but one as to the Father, by whom all things were made, who for us men for our salvation came down from heaven, and was incarnate of the Holy Spirit, of the Virgin Mary, and became man. And he was crucified for us under Pontius Pilate, suffered and was buried, and the third day he rose from the dead, according to the scriptures, ascended into the heavens, he sat at the right hand of his Father, and he is coming again in his glory to judge the living and the dead, whose kingdom shall have no end. Yes, we believe in the Holy Spirit, the Lord, the giver of life, who proceeds from the Father, who with the Father and the Son is worshipped and glorified, who is spoken by the prophets, and one holy God, the gospel of the church, we confess on baptism for the remission of sins. We look for the resurrection of the dead and the life of the age to come. Amen. To hear us, have mercy on us, and forgive us our sins. Amen.
mercy on us, O God, the Father, the Pontificator. O Holy Trinity, have mercy on us, O Lord God of hosts, be with us, for we have no help in our hardships or tribulations but you. Absolve, forgive, and remit, O God, our transgressions, those who have committed willingly and those who have committed unwillingly, those who have committed knowingly and those who have committed unknowingly. The hidden and manifest, the Lord, forgive us for the sake of your holy name, which is called upon us. Let it be according to your mercy, O Lord, not according to our sins. Lord in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. In Christ Jesus our Lord, for thine is the kingdom, the power of the Lord forever. Amen. Glory and honor, honor and glory to the all holy trinity, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, peace and edification to the one only holy Catholic and Apostolic Orthodox Church of God. Amen. Remember, O Lord, those who have brought to you these gifts, those on whose behalf they have been brought, and those by whom they have been brought. Give them all the heavenly reward. Pray for these holy and precious gifts, our sacrifices, and those who bring them, Lord, have mercy. And Fran, M. Fiot, M. Shirin, M. Bibnam, M. S. O. Web, O. Noti, N. O. O. F. S. Mara, O. N. J. F. Noti, Fiot, P. Pantokratur. F. S. Mara, O. N. J. B. F. Monogany, S. N. Shiri, S. O. S. B. Christos, P. N. Shoyz. Fizmaraut in Jibi ibn Fma Ithuab in Parakli. Ragios, yes, yes, ragios, and in the magion, amen. Logitos, kirios, or theos, yes, tos, eonas, amen. Net no stiro, es mo, ev shois, maro, es mo, rof, and jenny lao stiro, jab if night agro, eriagon, o timet me and tem shois, shop shine, amen. Alleluia. Sabbath, three, Sitter 
Maren Shibeh Moten Tot Fimberef Erbethlanef Owo Hernaid Ef Noti Ef Yotim Penchois Owo Ben Noti Owo Ben Sotir Isos Be A Christos Je Af Erisk Pazini Gon Af Ervoi Thineron Af Areh Eron Af Shop Tineruf Af Tiasu Eron Af Tito Tien Aventin Sha E Ehri E Tai O No Thai En Thuf On Maren Tiho Eruf Hoppos En Tif Areh Eron خن پای اهو از اوب فای نم نه اهو تیرون تبن آنخ خن هرینی نفن جپی پانتوکراتور پشایس بن نوتی روست بکساستی یریان ایسون او مسیر لورد گاد ذا پانتوکرا آتور the Father of our Lord, God and Savior, Jesus Christ, we thank you for everything, concerning everything and in everything, for you have covered us, helped us, guarded us, accepted us to yourself, spared us, supported us, and have brought us to this hour. Pray that God may have mercy and compassion on us, Hear us, help us, and accept the supplications and prayers of his saints, for that which is good on our behalf at all times, and to keep the life and standing of our honored Father, the Archpriest Pope Abba Tawadros the Seconds, and his partner in the Apostolic Liturgy, our Father, the Metropolitan Abba Yusuf, and his part in the Apostolic Liturgy, our Father, the Abba Basil, and his part in the Apostolic Liturgy, our Father, Bishop Abba Gregory, and make us worthy to partake of the communion of his holy and blessed mysteries for the remission of our sins. Lord, have mercy. Therefore, we ask and entreat your goodness O lover of mankind, grant us to complete this holy day and all the days of our life in all peace with your fear, all envy, all temptation, all the work of Satan, the counsel of wicked men, and the rising up of enemies hidden and manifest, take them away from us and from all your people and from this table and from this your holy place. But those things which are good and profitable do provide for us, for it is you who have given us the authority to tread on serpents and scorpions and upon all the power of the enemy. <laughs>
servants, ministers of this day, our father, the metropolitan, our father, the bishop, our fathers, the hegemons, our fathers, the priests, the deacons, the clergy, and all the people in my weakness be absolved from the mouth of the all-holy trinity, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit from out to one, only holy Catholic and apostolic church, Mount to all apostles, Mount to the older of God, the evangelist, Saint Mark, the holy apostle and martyr, patriarch, Saint Severus, our teacher, Dios Codos, Saint Athanasius, the apostolic, Saint Peter, the holy martyr, high priest, Saint John Chrysostom, Saint Cyril, Saint Basil, Saint Gregory, and from Mount 318, assemble at Nicaea, the 150 at Constantinople, and 200 at Ephesus, and from the Mount, our honored father, the patriarch, Pope Abba II, and his partners in the liturgy, our honored father, the metropolitan Abba Yusuf, and our honored Father, the Bishop of Abazel, and from my own mouth, being the least for blessed and full of glory, is your holy name, O Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. <laughs> Oh. 
Oh, 
servant of our Lord Jesus Christ, called to be an apostle, appointed to the gospel of God, a reading from the epistle of our teacher, Paul, to the Ephesians. May his holy blessings be with us. Amen. Children, obey your parents in the Lord, for this is right. Honor your father and mother, which is the first commandment of promise, that it may be well with you and you may live long on the earth. And you fathers, do not provoke your children to wrath, but bring them up in the training and admonition of the Lord. Bond servants, be obedient to those who are your master according to the flesh, with fear and trembling and sincerity of heart as to Christ, not with, not with eye service as men pleasers, but as bond servants of Christ doing the will of God from the heart, with good will doing service as to the Lord and not to men, knowing that whatever good anyone does, he will receive the same from the Lord, whether he is a slave or free. And you, masters, do the same thing to them, giving up, threatening, knowing that your master also is in heaven and there is no partiality with him. Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord, in the power of his might. Put on the whole armor of God, that you may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. For we do not wrestle against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of darkness of this age against spiritual hosts of wickedness in the heavenly places. Therefore, take up the whole armor of God, that you may be able to withstand in the evil day, and having done all, to stand. Stand, therefore, having girded your waist with truth, having put on the breastplate of righteousness, and having shod your feet with the preparation of the gospel of peace. Above all, taking the shield of faith with which you were able to quench all the fiery darts of the wicked one, and take the helmet of salvation and the sword of the Spirit, which is the word of God, praying always with all prayer and supplication in the Spirit, being watchful to this end with all perseverance and supplication for all the saints. And for me, that utterance may be given to me, that I may, be open, that I may open my mouth boldly to make known the mystery of the gospel, for which I am an ambassador in chains, that in it I may speak boldly as I ought to speak, but that you may also know my affairs and how I am doing. Tychicus, a beloved brother and faithful minister in the Lord, will make all things known to you, whom I have sent to you for this very purpose, that you may know our affairs and that he may comfort your hearts. Peace to the brethren and love with faith from God the Father and the Lord Jesus Christ. The grace of God the Father be with you all. Amen. The Catholic Epistle from the first epistle of our teacher, St. John. May his holy blessings be with us. Amen. 
Brethren, I write no new commandment to you, but an old commandment which you have had from the beginning. The old commandment is the word which you heard from the beginning. Again, a new commandment I write to you, which thing is true in him and in you, because the darkness is passing away and the true light is already shining. He who says he is in the light and hates his brother is in darkness until now. He who loves his brother abides in the light and there is no cause for stumbling in him. But he who hates his brother is in darkness and walks in darkness and does not know, does not know that where he is going because the darkness has blinded his eyes. I write to you, little children, because your sins are forgiven you for his name's sake. I write to you, fathers, because you have known him who is from the beginning. I write to you, young men, because you have overcome the wicked one. I write to you, little children, because you have known the Father. I have written to you, fathers, because you have known him who is from the beginning. I have written to you, young men, because you are strong and the word of God abides in you, and you have overcome the wicked one. Do not love the world or the things in the world. If anyone loves the world, and the, the love of the Father is not in him. For all that is in the world, the lust of the flesh, the lust of the eyes, and the pride of life is not of the Father, but is of the world. And the world is passing away in the lust of it. But he who does the will of God abides forever. Do not love the world or the things in the world. The world is passing away in its lust, but he who does the will of God abides forever. Amen.
fathers, the pure apostles who are invested with the grace of the Holy Spirit. May their blessing be with us all. Amen. After the uproar had ceased, Paul called the disciples to himself, embraced them, and departed to go to Macedonia. Now when he had gone over that region and encouraged them with many words, he came to Greece and stayed three months. And when the Jews plotted against him as he was about to sail to Syria, he decided to return through Macedonia. And Sopater of Berea accompanied him to Asia, also Aristarchus and Secundus of the Thessalonians, and Gaius of Derbe, and Timothy, and Tychicus, and Trophimus of Asia. 
These men going ahead waited for us at Tross. But we sailed away from Philippi after the days of unleavened bread, and in five days joined them at Tross, where we stayed seven days. Now on the first day of the week, when the disciples came together to break bread, Paul, ready to depart the next day, spoke to them and continued his message until midnight. There were many lamps in the upper room where they were gathered together, and in a window sat a certain young man named Itychus, who was sinking into a deep sleep. He was overcome by sleep, and as Paul continued speaking, he fell down from the third story and was taken up dead. But Paul went down, fell on him, and embracing him, said, Do not trouble yourselves, for his life is in him. Now when he had come up, had broken bread and eaten, and talked a long while, even till daybreak, he departed. And they brought the young man in alive, and they were not a little comforted. The word of the Lord shall grow, multiply, be mighty, and be confirmed in the Holy Church of God. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, one God, amen. Today is the 14th day of the blessed month of Mithra. May God begin it in goodness and in unity for us in peace and tranquility. While our sins and iniquities are forgiven through the tender mercies of our Lord, amen. On this day, the church celebrates the commemoration of the great sign which God manifested during the papacy of Pope Theophilus, the 23rd Patriarch of Alexandria. There was in the city of Alexandria a very wealthy Jewish man whose name was Felixenus. He closely followed the practices of the law of Moses. There was also in the city two poor Christian men. One of them said, why do we worship Christ and remain poor while this Jewish man, Felixenus, is very rich? The other man answered him, saying, The possessions of this world are not counted before God, for if it was, he would not give, he would not give it to the worshippers of idols, adulterers, thieves, and murderers. For the riches of this world are not an evidence for the approval of God. For this reason, the prophets and the apostles were poor. The man was not convinced, so he went to Felixenus the Jew and asked him to accept him in his service. Felixenus replied, It is not lawful for me to employ anyone unless he believed in my faith. But if you want a charity, I can give you. He replied, saying, Take me to your house, and I will adopt your faith, and I will do whatsoever you command me. Felixenus took him to their synagogue, and the ruler of the synagogue asked him before the Jewish congregation, saying, Have you denied your Christ? And would you be a Jew like us? He replied, yes. That debased man rejected his Christ and added to his poverty and money, poverty and faith. Then the ruler of the synagogue commanded them to make for him a cross of wood and gave him a reed, and on top of which was a sponge full of vinegar and a spear. Then he told them, spit upon this cross, offer to him this vinegar, and pierce the cross with this spear and say, I pierce you, O Christ. That man did everything as he was commanded. When he pierced the honorable cross, blood and water flowed forth and ran down on the ground. Then this apostate dropped dead and dried up like a rock. Great fear fell upon all those who were present. Many of them believed and cried out, saying, We believe in the Lord Christ, the true God. Then they took from the blood, anointed their faces and eyes. Felixenus took also some of the blood and sprinkled it on his blind daughter, and immediately she was able to see. He and his entire family believed in many others of the Jews. When Pope Theophilus heard of this wonder, he took some of the priests and the people and went to the Jewish synagogue, where he saw the cross and the blood. The Pope took from the blood, blessed himself, and also blessed the people. He wiped the blood off the floor, put it in a vessel, and kept it as a blessing. He ordered to move the wooden cross to the church, Afterwards, those who were present confessed their faith before the Pope, who baptized them in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, became Christians and glorified God. The blessing of the Honorable Cross be with us and all, with us all, and glory be to our God forever. Amen. <laughs> Thank you. 
O Master, Lord Jesus Christ, our God, who said to his saintly disciples and holy apostles, many prophets and righteous men have desired to see the things which you see and have not seen them, and to hear the things which you hear and have not heard them. But as for you, blessed are your eyes, for they hear, and your ears, for they hear. For your eyes, for they see, and your ears, for they hear. May we be worthy to hear and to act according to your holy gospels through the prayers of your saints. May Remember us, our Master, all those who have bidden us to remember them in our supplications and prayers, which we offer up unto you, O Lord our God. Those who have already fallen asleep, repose them. Those who are sick, heal them. For you are the life of us all, the salvation of us all, the hope of us all, the healing of us all, and the resurrection of us all. If Eon Henneke Jiviri Volen Jenny Feel a whip choice Nem Tek Meth Me Henetek Lise Antenny Eth So on, MPH Lilo, we are chicken F Ah, 
Stand in the fear of God and let us listen to the Holy Gospel, a reading from the Holy Gospel, according to our teacher, St. Luke the Evangelist. May his blessings be with us all. Amen. From the Psalms of our teacher, David the prophet and king, may his blessings be with us all. Amen. The heavens shall declare your wonders, O Lord, and your truth in the assembly of the saints. Blessed is the people that know this joyful sound. They shall walk, O Lord, in the light of your countenance. Let them exalt him in the church of his people and praise him in the seat of the elders, for he has made the family like a flock of sheep. The upright shall see and rejoice. The Lord has sworn and will have no regret. You are a priest forever after the order of Melchizedek. The Lord is at your right hand, our saintly father, the patriarch, Pope Abba Tawadros II, and our father, the metropolitan, Abba Yusuf, and our father, the bishop, Abba Matthias, and our father, the bishop, Abba Gregory. May the Lord keep your lives. Amen. comes in the name of the Lord, our Lord, God, Savior, and King of us all, Jesus Christ, Son of the living God, to whom is due the glory After these things, he went out and saw a tax collector named Levi sitting at the tax office, and he said to him, Follow me. And he left all, rose up, and followed him. Then Levi gave him a great feast in his own house, and there were a great number of tax collectors and others who sat down with them. But their scribes and the Pharisees murmured against his disciples, saying, Why do you eat and drink with tax collectors and sinners? And Jesus answered and said to them, Those who are well do not need a physician, but those who are sick. I have not come to call the righteous, but sinners to repentance. Then they said to him, Why do the disciples of John fast often? and make prayers, and likewise those of the Pharisees, but yours eat and drink. And he said to them, Can you make the friends of the bridegroom fast while the bridegroom is with them? But the days will come when the bridegroom will be taken away from them. Then they will fast in those days. Then he spoke a parable to them, no one puts a piece from a new garment on an old one. Otherwise the new makes a tear, and also the piece that was taken out of the new does not match the old. And no one puts new wine into old wineskins, or else the new wine will burst the wineskins and be spilled, and the wineskins will be ruined. But new wine must be put into new wineskins, and both are preserved. And no one having drunk old wine immediately desires new, for he says, the old is better. Glory be to God for
In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, one God, Amen. Uh, first, congratulations to all of us and to the congregation and to Mina and his family on the upcoming uh, ordination. Uh, today is the second Sunday of the blessed month of Misra. And during the month of Misra, the church prepares us for the end of the Coptic year. And so the readings point to a review of self, repentance, the end of times, and so on. Last week, we heard uh, the parable of the vine dressers and how the Lord sends different servants, the internal conscience, the laws, the prophets, the people around us, and his own messages to us to awaken us. And where are the fruits of basically the, 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 what he's entrusted us with? and how we respond to this. Today we hear about Levi, the tax collector, who responds to this calling. And so I'll meditate on his response, but before I jump into his response, there's a passage in this gospel that is beautiful, that reassures us. It says that in the beginning of the reading this morning, it says that the Lord, um, he saw a tax collector named Levi. He saw him. And the word saw here signifies that he sees beneath the surface. And oftentimes in our own lives, we feel like no one sees us. We hear this a lot. Nobody sees me. And a gospel like this reassures me that God sees me. The Lord sees, and he doesn't see the superficial things alone. He doesn't see just the sins. He doesn't just see the ugliness. He doesn't just see the weaknesses. He sees the depth. He sees beneath all that. And that's why he's capable of seeing this sinner, this tax collector, this man who's rejected by all norms in society, in the Jewish culture that they were in. And he's able to say to this man who's rejected by all, follow me. I want to make you something different. I want you to serve with me. But how, Lord? How are you choosing a sinner like this? How are you choosing someone who's rejected by all? How would you choose me? knowing all the filth that's there. And he would say to each one of us, I see the depth. I see the beauty that I created beneath all this. It's hidden beneath all that junk that's covering it up. And I see it and I wanna bring it out. And this is what he does with Levi, the tax collector. But in order for me to be transformed the way Levi, the tax collector was transformed, I need to understand that I have to respond to this calling. Levi responded, and so we'll look very briefly at his response. The first thing is Levi responds quickly. The Lord says to him, follow me. And the very next verse it says, so he left all, rose up and followed him. Such an odd thing. He doesn't consider, what about my job? What about what people are gonna say? What about my, my wealth? He just leaves everything and goes about following the Lord. Oftentimes we hear God's voice in our own lives whispering in our ears, follow me. Follow me and serve me. Serve me in a particular capacity in the church. Serve me within your family. Serve me in this or that way. Maybe the follow me is follow me in that I want you to reject sin. Follow me and leave your sinful life. Repent and follow me. Whatever the follow me is, we hear it every day. He whispers in our ears, follow me. And how do we respond? Sometimes we hear it, but we act like we didn't hear it because we fear. What if I follow him? What will I do then? What does that mean? What are these sacrifices that I'm going to make entail in my life? What if I leave this sin? Will I find pleasure elsewhere? What if I leave this thing that I'm doing? What if I serve him and commit to the church like you know, certain people like Mina are committing? following that calling and responding to it. What happens afterward? There's so many unknowns. Levi responds immediately. He doesn't consider these things, but he responds immediately, quickly, like Abraham in the Old Testament, and like all the saints that came before us. They didn't let these questions hinder their response, but they moved immediately. I'm called, and so I must respond. And so St. Matthew, the Levi, the tax collector, responds. St. Paul tells us, in his epistle to the Hebrews today, if you will hear his voice, do not harden your hearts. Today, not tomorrow, today. 
If you hear him knocking on the door of your heart saying, repent, repent today. If you hear him knocking and saying, serve me, serve and accept the service today. Don't keep delaying. Number two, he responds with change. There's a change in his life. And so he, he leaves a certain way of life in order to follow the Lord. The Lord gives this parable at the end and he says, no one puts a piece from a new garment on an old one. Otherwise, the new makes a tear, and also that piece that was taken out of the new does not match the old. It's like patches on an old garment when sometimes we respond partially. That's the old. We respond partially to the calling of the Lord. We want to serve, maybe. We want to come to church. We want to do certain things. But we also want to live our lives however it is that it pleases us outside. And so I don't want to leave a particular sin or a particular behavior or a particular way of life. And so I have a foot in and a foot out. An hour with the Lord and an hour outside with my friends doing whatever it is that I want to do. But the Lord here says, this doesn't work. It's not going to be practical. This type of patchy life doesn't lead anywhere. It's not going to glorify God. And it's not going to bring you anywhere. And so think of St. Augustine. St. Augustine, he lived a sinful life, had a child out of wedlock, and he struggled with his conversion initially. And one of his beautiful prayers, at least it was sincere, he said, Lord, grant me purity, but not now. He wants to be purified, but he's also attached to the pleasures. How can I let go of these pleasures? They're, they're the things that I feel taste good. Kind of like, again, in the next parable at the end, he says, no one puts new wine into an old wineskin. This, or, or, or else the new wine will burst the wineskins and be spilled, and the wineskins will be ruined. This idea of the new wine. No one puts new wine, but the old, old tastes good, right? And so sometimes we feel like the old sin, what I'm familiar with, what is pleasurable to me, tastes good. And I don't know what comes next. And yet the psalmist is capable of saying, taste and see that the Lord is good. Once I taste, then that old stuff is not, it's not pleasant at all. But I fear tasting. Taste and see that the Lord is good. Once I taste him like St. Matthew did, there's a transformation. Once I taste him, I realize that that old stuff that I thought was pleasurable doesn't satisfy. That's why we're still anxious and still miserable and still not joyful. And so to embark on this. Number three, he responds with trust. He trusts him. When the Lord says, follow me, okay. I mean, this is a man with no reputation. This is a man who's not favored by others. This is a man who could have questioned the calling itself. Could have said, I'm a sinner. I'm hated by all. How can I follow you? I'm not qualified. And then the Lord would respond and say, as long as you trust in me, then everything will be fine. He calls us to a life of holiness, and we don't understand. How can I live a holy life in this world? But if I respond and say, yes, Lord, I want to. Yes, Lord, I'll struggle for it. Yes, Lord, I'll make the sacrifices necessary for it. He'll begin to give us the grace in order to fight and bit by bit to live that life of holiness by his grace. If he calls us to a life of service, like St. Matthew, he gives the grace. You know, there's the common saying, he does, not he does not call the qualified, but he qualifies the called. He's the one that qualifies. He's the one that gives the grace, whether it be in a service, whether it be in a life of holiness, whether it be in a life of repentance, but to respond with that particular change and not, or with the, tr with the trust that St. Matthew had, to trust him. And finally, the last thing is he responds with a banquet. The banquet here signifies joy. He's, he's, he's throwing a party, basically. This, he says, Levi gave him a great feast in his own house. He's joyful at the transformation in his own life. And so he wants to share it with others, and he throws a feast, shares the joy. He's joyful. Our houses should be like that, inviting the Lord into our homes, rejoicing in him, having tasted him daily in our life of repentance, in our service, in following him, whatever way he calls us to follow him, to rejoice in him in our homes with our families, to rejoice with him in our homes when we invite others, to share him with others as St. Matthew did, to share that joy 
and to share the, the, what, the, the way he's transformed us with others. Um, sometimes, like I said earlier, we feel like the things that seem pleasure to us, it's unimaginable to understand how I can live without these things. But St. Matthew here shows us the joy that occurs after, when I let go and when I embark and when I trust and I change my life, I see joy in my own life. St. Gregory of Nyssa says this short thing, this short passage, which is beautiful. He says, God is not pain, but he is pleasure. And sometimes we think life with God is painful, but it's truly pleasurable if we allow him to work with us. Sometimes we resist his work in our lives. We resist responding and saying, yes, Lord, I will follow you. But when I respond and I say, yes, Lord, I accept the invitation. Yes, Lord, I will follow you. When I leave all like St. Matthew did and follow him, then I'll experience what St. Gregory of Nyssa says. God is not pain, but he is joy. Four things. Number one, Levi responds quickly. Number two, he responds with trust. Number three, he responds with genuine change. And finally, number four, he responds with a banquet or joy in his life. And to our God be the glory now and ever and unto the ages of the ages. Amen. Again, let us ask God the Pantocrator, the Father of our Lord, God and Savior, Jesus Christ. We ask and entreat your goodness, O lover of mankind. Remember, O Lord, the peace of your one only holy Catholic and Apostolic Church. Pray for the peace of the one holy, Catholic, and Apostolic Orthodox Church of God. Lord have mercy. This which exists from one end of the world to the other, all peoples and all flocks, bless the heavenly peace, send down into all our hearts, even the peace of this life graciously grant to us, the leader, the armies, the rulers, the counselors, the multitudes, our neighbors, are coming in and are going out. Adorn them with all peace. O King of peace, grant us your peace. 
for you have given us all things. Acquire us to yourself, O God, our Savior, for we know none other but you. Your holy name we utter. May our souls live by your Holy Spirit, and let not the death of sin have dominion over us, we your servants, nor over all your people. Lord have mercy. Again, it is as Gandha Bandhu Kratur, the Father of our Lord God and Savior, Jesus Christ. We ask and entreat your goodness, a lover of mankind, to remember, O Lord, our honored patriarch and father, the high priest, Pope Ava Tawadro II, and his spiritual brethren, the patriarch of Antioch, Mary Ignatius, Ephraim II, and his partners in the apostolic liturgy, our father, the metropolitan Abba Yusuf, and our fathers, the bishops, Abba Matthias, Abba Bezil and Abba Gregory. Pray for Archpriest Pope Abba Tawadros II, Pope and Patriarch and Archbishop of the Great City of Alexandria, and his brother in apostolic liturgy, the Patriarch of Antioch, Margonatius Ephraim II, and his partners in the apostolic liturgy, our Father the Metropolitan, our Father the Bishop of Amentias, our Father the Bishop of Basil. Our Father, the Bishop of Gregory, and for Orthodox Bishops. Lord have mercy. Keep them secure for us for many years and peaceful times, fulfilling that, that holy high priesthood with which you have entrusted them for yourself according to your holy and blessed will. Rightly handling the word of true shepherding and people in purity and righteousness and all the orthodox bishops, sigamans, priests and deacons and all the fullness of your one only holy Catholic and apostolic church grant them in us peace and safety in every place their prayers which they offer on our behalf and on behalf of all your people as well as ours on their behalf receive them upon your holy rational altar in heaven as a sweet savor of incense all their enemies visible and invisible trample and eat under their feet speedily as for them, keep them in peace and righteousness in your holy church. Lord have mercy. Again, let us ask God the Pantocrator, the Father of our Lord, God and Savior, Jesus Christ. We ask and entreat your goodness, O lover of mankind. Remember, O Lord, our assemblies bless them. Pray for this holy church and for our assemblies. Lord have mercy. Grant that they may be to us without obstacle or hindrance, that we may hold them according to your holy and blessed will. Houses of prayer, houses of purity, houses of blessing, grant them to us, O Lord, and to all your servants who will come after us forever. The worship of idols utterly uproot from the world. Satan and all his evil powers trample and humiliate them under our feet speedily. The offenses and their instigators abolish. Let the dissensions of corrupt heresies cease. The enemies of your holy church, O Lord, as at all times now also humiliate. Strip their vanity, show them their weakness speedily. Bring to naught their envies, their intrigues, their madness, their wickedness and their slanders which they commit against us. O Lord, bring them all to no avail. Disperse their counsel, O God, who dispersed the counsel of Aithophel. Amen, Lord of mercy. Arise, O Lord God, let all your enemies be scattered, and let all those who hate your holy name flee from before your face. As for your people, let them be in blessing a thousand, thousandfold, and ten thousand times ten thousandfold, doing your holy will. So fea teo e bros homen, Kenyala is on, Kenyala is on, Geno miss me. We believe in one God, God the Father, the Pantocrator, creator of heaven and earth, and all things seen and unseen. We believe in one Lord Jesus Christ, the only begotten Son of God, begotten of the Father before all ages, light of light, true God of true God. 
Three God and not created. Among us with the Father, by whom all things were made, who for us men and for our salvation came down from heaven, was incarnate of the Holy Spirit, and the Virgin Mary became man. And he was crucified for us under Pontius Pilate, the suffering was buried, and the third day he rose from the dead, according to the scriptures, ascended into the heavens, he sits at the right hand of his Father, he is coming again in his glory, judge of the living and the dead, whose kingdom shall have no end. Yes, we believe in the Holy Spirit, the Lord, the giver of life, who proceeds from the Father, who the Father, the Son is worshipped and glorified, who spoke by the prophets, and one holy Catholic Apostolic Church, we confess the baptism for the remission of sins. We look for the resurrection of the dead and the life of the age to come. Ah, amen. I have sinned, forgive me. formed man in corruption and death which entered into the world through the envy of the devil you have destroyed by the life giving manifestation of your only begotten son our Lord God and Savior Jesus Christ you have filled the earth with the heavenly peace by which is all the angel glory for you saying Glory to God in the highest peace on earth and good will to world men. Pray for perfect peace, love, and the holy apostle in According to your good will, O God, fill our hearts with your peace, cleanse us from all blemish, all guile, all hypocrisy, all malice, and the remembrance of evil, and telling death. Make us all worthy, our master, to greet one another with a holy kiss that without falling into condemnation we may partake of your immortal and heavenly gift in Christ Jesus our Lord.
ordination of our brother Mina Hanna. Please, everybody stay in their places. Do not move. Even after the ordination, please don't come inside to congratulate the new priest. Now in front of you, uh, Deacon Mina, if you approve his ordination as a priest for this church, say Axios. Second step of the ordination is a vow of commitment. Abuna Mikhail will uh, read it to him and he will uh, repeat it after. I mean the unworthy. I mean the unworthy. Who is called for the grace of the priesthood. Who is called for the grace of the priesthood. On the holy altar of the one holy, universal, and apostolic Orthodox Church of God. On the holy altar of the one holy Catholic and Apostolic Orthodox Church of God. In the Diocese of the Southern United States. In the Diocese of the Southern United States. The beloved of Christ. The beloved of Christ. I vow before God. I vow before God. The Lord of Lords and the Shepherd of the Shepherds. The Lord of Lords and the Shepherds of Shepherds. And for his angels and saints, and before my father, his holiness, Pope Taudru II. And before his angels and saints, and before my father, his holiness, Pope Taudru II. My father, the Metropolitan Ava Yusuf. And my father, the Metropolitan Ava Yusuf. My father, the Bishop of Met Bishop Matthias and Bishop Basil and Bishop Gregory. And my father, of the Bishops Matthias. Bishop. Basil, Bishop Gregory. And before all the clergy and all the people. And before all clergy and all people. To be steadfast in the Holy Orthodox faith. To be steadfast in the Holy Orthodox faith. Until the last breath. Until the last breath. To respect the canons of the Holy Church. To respect the canons of the Holy Church. And to keep all her, her traditions and to keep all her traditions, rites, religious customs, rites, religious customs, and teachings, and teachings. I will make every effort to teach the people, I will make every effort to teach the people, the true faith and lead them in a holy and righteous life, the true faith and lead them in a holy and righteous life, and to be an example for them in every good deed, and to be an example for them in every good deed. I vow to love the flock, I vow to love the flock and deal with them in compassion and wisdom and deal with them in compassion and wisdom. I vow to give myself for all the people in pastoral care. I vow to give myself for all the people in pastoral care and being concerned for them in every respect and being concerned for them in every respect to the very last of my abilities to the very last of my abilities. I will search for the lost I will search for the lost and try to return him and try to return him. I will gather the scattered flock of God. I will gather the scattered flock of God. I will not ignore the incapacitated. I will not ignore the incapacitated. The rejected. The rejected. Or those who have no one to remember them. Or those who have no one to remember them. I will be patient and long suffering. I will be patient and be long suffering. In dealing with all the people and will not show partiality to choosing group. In dealing with all people and will not show partiality in, to a chosen group. But be equality concerned for all. But be equally concerned for all. I vow to put the Lord Christ. I vow to put the Lord Christ. And his church before everything else. And his church before everything else. I will stay away from the love of money. I will stay away from the love of money. And loving the bigger portion. 
in loving the bigger portion. I will not boast over the people. I will not boast over the people. Nor will ever neglect them. Nor will ever neglect them. Or overburden them. Or overburden them. I will not order them against the commandment of the Lord. I will not order them against the commandment of the Lord. And will never reject the repentant. And will never reject the repentant. When he returns to the church. When he returns to the church. But I will serve all them of them. I will, but I will serve all of them. I vow to submit to the hierarchy of the priesthood. I vow to submit the hierarchy of the priesthood. Represented in person of His Holiness the Pope of Alexandria. Represented in person of His Holiness the Pope of Alexandria. And Patriarch of the See of Saint Mark. And Patriarch of the See of Saint Mark. And His His Eminence Metropolitan Yusuf. And His Eminence Metropolitan Yusuf. The Metropolitan of the United States of America. The Metropolitan of the Third of the United States of America. Along with my respect and honor. Along with my respect and honor. To their eminence and the graces. To their eminence and graces. The Metropolitans, the Bishop of the Church. The Metropolitans and the Bishops of the Church. I ask the Lord to grant me strength. I ask the Lord to grant me strength. Through your prayers. Through your prayers. So that I may fulfill the duties of this great of office of the Honorable priesthood. So that I may fulfill the duties of this great office of the honorable priesthood. With honesty and integrity. With honesty and integrity. Pray for me, my father, and my brethren, the saints, a matanya of all of you. Pray for me, my fathers and brothers, the saints, a matanya for all of you. Have mercy on us, O God, the Father, the Pantocrator, our Holy Trinity. Have mercy on us, O Lord, God of hosts. Be with us. We have no other help in our tribulations and adversities but you. Make us, O Lord, worthy to pray thankfully. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. In Christ Jesus, our Lord, thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever. Amen. Marin <laughs> O Master, Lord God, the Pantocrator, the Father of our Lord, God and Savior, Jesus Christ, we thank you for everything concerning everything and in everything, for you have covered us, helped us, guarded us, accepted us to yourself, spared us, supported us, and have brought us to this hour. Pray that God have mercy and compassion upon us. Hear us and help us, and accept the supplication and prayers of the saints which is a good hour we have at all times, and forgive us our sins. Lord, have mercy. Therefore, we ask.
ask and entreat your goodness, O lover of mankind. Grant us to complete this holy day and all the days of our life in all peace with your fear. All envy, all temptation, all the work of Satan, the counsel of wicked men and the rising up of enemies hidden and manifest, take them away from us and from all your people and from this your servant and from this your holy place. But those things which are good and profitable do provide them for us, for it is you who have given us the authority to tread upon serpents and scorpions and upon all the power of the enemy. <laughs> who have set us in the inheritance of this ministry, who knows the minds of men and examine hearts and reins. Hear us according to the multitude of your mercies and cleanse us from every defilement of body and spirit. Take away our sins like a cloud and our iniquities like darkness. Fill us with your power and the grace of your only Son and the working of your most Holy Spirit. Make us sufficient that we may be ministers of your new covenant so that we may be able as befits your holy name to stand before you 
to perform the priestly ministry for your divine mysteries and do not abandon us to participate in the sins of others, but rather wipe out our own and grant to us, O Lord, that we may do nothing wrong through error, but give us knowledge to choose those who are worthy and to present them to you and accept as a presbyter and make perfect this servant, Yemina, who is here at present and awaits your heavenly gift. For you are kind and very merciful toward all who call upon you, and strong is your power and that of your only Son and of your most Holy Spirit. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, who supplies our deficiency through the beneficence of God the Father and the Holy Spirit, shall come upon your servant Mina, who has approached the altar in fear and trembling and humility, kneeling and lifting the eyes of his heart to heaven, to you who are in heaven, awaiting from it your heavenly gift, so that he might pass from the rank of the diaconate to the rank of the presbyterate in the church and the altar of the Coptic Orthodox Diocese of the Southern United States of God. Pray all of you that the Holy Spirit might come upon him. Amen. 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 Yes, Lord, make your servant worthy of the calling of the presbyterate, so that he may deserve through your kindness as befits your holy name to labor and serve in the temple of your glory and find mercy before you. For you are a merciful and compassionate God, and to you is due glory, honor, and dominion, and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto age of all ages. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Our Master, Lord God Almighty, who created all things by your co-eternal Logos, exercising providence over the universe through him also, according to your will, which looks at all times on your holy church and makes it increase and those who preside in it, making them multiply and giving them strength to labor in word and deed. Look upon your servant Mina, who has been made a presbyter by the vote and judgment of those who have brought him in the midst, Fill him with Holy Spirit and grace and counsel, fearing you so that he might help and guide your people with a pure heart, just as you looked over your people, whom you chose and commanded your servant Moses to choose for himself presbyters, whom you ordained by an uncreated Holy Spirit, which proceeds from you. Let us pray. Yes, Lord, hear us as we beseech you, and preserve in us also the Holy Spirit of your grace, which is uncreated. Grant him the spirit of your wisdom, so that filled with works of healing and instructive speech, he might teach your people in meekness, and serve you in purity with a clean mind and a willing soul, that he might perform the functions of the priesthood over your people, those who will approach him, that he might renew them through the regeneration of baptism. As for me, cleanse me from all sins of others and free me from those which are my very own through the mediation of your only begotten Son, our Lord and our God and our Savior, Jesus Christ. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Look upon us, O Lord, and on your ministry and cleanse us from every stain while you give grace from heaven to this your servant so that he may deserve by your kindness blamelessly to be occupied in this ministry to which you have called him and find your mercy with all who through the ages have pleased you for you are God who wills mercy and kindness and from all is due glory, honor, and adoration to you and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. We call you in the Holy Orthodox Church of God. Amen. Amen. We call you, Noah, a presbyter on the Holy Altar of St. Mary that's named for the Orthodox in the city of Colville, Texas, in the Coptic Orthodox Diocese of the Southern United States of America. Amen. Amen. 
ندعوك يا نواقسيس على المسبح المقدس على الذي دعي للأرثوذكسيين على اسم السيدة العذراء في مدينة كوليفيل تكساس إبارشية جنوب الولايات المتحدة الأمريكية خنفران إم فيوت نم بشيري نم ببنما إثواب أنوت إن أوت فز ما رأوت إن جي إف نوت فيوت ببانتوكراتو Fiz marot in jepef monogenis in shiri Jesus be Christos ben shois. Fiz marot in jepef monogenis in shiri Jesus be Christos Honor, honor and glory to the all Holy Trinity, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Peace and edification to the one only Holy Catholic and Apostolic Orthodox Church of God. Amen. to do with us and poured out your gift on this your servant. Again we ask and beseech you, O Lord, hear us according to the multitude of your mercies, and may this ordination to the presbyterate be pleasing to you, which has been performed on this your servant through the coming of your most holy spirit. To the calling, add also the election and the sanctity, the grace of your goodness, and choose us and him for good, and grant to him that he may labor for you in the talent which he has received, so that with all those who have done your will, he may receive the reward of faithful and wise steward at the second coming from heaven of our Lord, our God and our Savior, Jesus Christ, with whom glory and dominion, glory, honor and dominion are due to you, with your good and most holy spirit, now and ever and unto age of all ages. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Greet one another with holy kiss. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Yeah, Lord, who are Jesus Christ, the Son of God, hear us and have mercy upon us. 
Offer, offer, offer an order, stand with your Lord to these, let us attend. Through the intercessions of the Theotokos, St. Mary, O Lord, grant us the forgiveness of our sins. We worship you, O Christ, with your good Father. you all and with your spirit lift up your hearts we to the Lord. It is me and right. Meet and right, meet and right, truly indeed it is meet and right. O you the being, Master, Lord, God of truth, being before the ages and reigning forever, who dwells in the highest and looks upon the lowly, who has created the heaven, the earth, the sea, and all that is therein, the Father of our Lord, God and Savior, Jesus Christ by whom you have created all things visible and invisible, who is seated upon the throne of his glory, and who is worshipped by all the holy power. You who are seated, stand before whom stand the angels, the archangels, the principality, the authority, the thrones, the dominions, and the powers. Look towards the Seraphimus, six wings, praising continuously without ceasing, saying, Let us attend. The cherubim worship you, and the seraphim glorify you, proclaiming and saying, Formed 
us, created us, and placed us in the paradise of joy. When we disobeyed your commandment by the deceit of the serpent, we fell from eternal life and were exiled from the paradise of joy. You have not abandoned us to the end, but have always visited us through your holy prophets. And in the last days you manifested yourself to us, who are sitting in darkness in the shadow of death, through your only begotten Son, our Lord God and Savior, Jesus Christ, who of the Holy Spirit and of the Holy Virgin Mary. Salvation, he granted us the birth of our through water and spirit. He made us unto himself an assembled people and sanctified us by the Holy Spirit. He loved his own who were in the world and as a ransom on our behalf. Gave himself up unto death which reigned over us, whereby we're bound and sold on account of our sins. He descended into hell through the Set at your right hand, O Father, as appointed a day for recompense on which he will appear to judge the world in righteousness and give each one according to his deal. This great mystery of godliness for being determined to give himself up to death for the life of the are without spot or blemish, blessed and life-giving. We believe that this is true. Towards heaven to you, O God, who are his father and master of everyone, and when he had given thanks, he he blessed it, he sanctified it. 
saintly disciples and holy apostles saying <coughs> take it of it all of you for this is my body which is broken for you and for many to be given for the remission of sins this do in remembrance of me. <coughs> Likewise also the cup after supper, he mixed it of wine and water, and when he had given thanks, Amen. he blessed it. Amen. He sanctified it. Also to his own saintly disciples and holy apostles, say, Take the drink of it, all of you, for this is my blood of the new covenant, which is shed for you and for many to be given for the remission of sins. This do. Merci. 
Therefore, as we also commemorate his holy passion, his resurrection from the dead, his ascension into the heavens, his sitting at your right hand, O Father, and his second coming from the heavens, awesome and full of glory, we offer unto you your gifts from what is yours, for everything concerning everything and in everything. Worship God in fear and trembling. We praise you, we bless you, we serve you, we worship you. Oh, oh, let us attend. into his holy body. I believe. Amen. And this cup also is a precious blood of his new covenant. Again I believe. Eternal life to those who partake of Him. Amen, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Yeah, we ask you, O Christ our God, Confirm the foundation of the church. Lord have mercy. The oneness of heart that is of love, may it take root in us. May the righteousness of faith grow, straighten for us the way of godliness. Lord have mercy. Control the shepherds and those whom the shepherd confirm. Give splendor to the clergy, asceticism to the monks. Lord, have mercy. Purity to those in virginity, a life of goodness to those in wedlock. Mercy to those in repentance, goodness to the rich. Lord, have mercy. Meekness to the honorable, help to the poor. Strengthen the elders, chasten the young. Lord, have mercy. Restore the unbelievers. May the schisms of the church cease. Strip the vanity of the heretics and count us all in the unity of Godliness. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Make us all worthy, O our Master, to partake of your holies unto the purification of our souls, bodies, and spirits, that we may become one body and one spirit, 
and may have a share and inheritance with all the saints who have pleased you since the beginning. Remember, O Lord, the peace of your one only holy Catholic and Apostolic Church. Pray for the peace of the one holy Catholic and Apostolic Orthodox Church of God. Lord have mercy. Grace which you acquired yourself with the precious blood of your Christ, give her in peace with all the Orthodox bishops who are in her. For most remember, O Lord, our blessed honor, Father, our patriarch, Baba Abba, to Adrus II, his spiritual brother, Patriarch Vantiak, Mary Ignatius from the second, and his partner in the liturgy, our honor, Father, the Metropolitan Abba Yusuf, and his partner in the liturgy, our bishops, Ava Matthias, Ava Basil, and Ava Gregory. Pray for Archbishop Pope Abba Tawadros II, Pope and Patriarch and Archbishop of the Great City of Alexandria, and his brother in apostolic liturgy, the Patriarch of Antioch, Mark Ignatius Ephraim II, and his partners in the liturgy, our Father Metropolitan Abba Yusuf, and our fathers, the bishops, Amba Matthias, Amba Bez, and Amba Gregory, and four Orthodox bishops. Lord, have mercy. And those who rightly define the word of truth with him, grant them unto the Holy Church, to shepherd a flock in peace, Remember, O Lord, the Orthodox Hegemon's priests and deacons. Pray for the Hegemon's priests, deacons, subdeacons, and the seven orders of the Church of God. Lord, have mercy. And all the servants and all who are in virginity and purity of your faithful people. Remember, O Lord, to have mercy upon us all. Have mercy upon us, O God, the Father, the Son, to Remember, O Lord, salvation is this holy place, and every place and every monastery are Zoxfazars. Pray for the salvation of the world of this city of ours and all cities, countries, islands, and monasteries. Those who dwell there in God, face grace accord, O Lord, to place the war of the river year. Pray for the rising of the water of the river this year, that Christ our God may bless them and raise them according to their measure that we may have joy to the face of the earth, sustain us the Son of Man, save the cattle, and forgive us our sins. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Raise them to their measure, According to your grace, give joy to the face of the earth. May its furrows be abundantly watered and its fruits be plentiful. Prepare it for sowing and harvesting. Manage our life as deemed fit. Bless the crown of the year with your goodness. For the sake of the poor of your people, the widow, the orphan, the traveler, the stranger. And for the sake of all of us who entreat you and seek your holy name. You give them the food in due season, deal with us according to your goodness. Who will give food to all flesh, fill our hearts with joy and gladness, that we to having sufficiency in everything, always may abound in every good. 
brought to you these gifts, those on whose behalf they have been brought, and those by whom they have been brought. Give them all the heavenly reward. Pray for these holy precious gifts, our sacrifices, and those who bring them. Dimitrios, Nimpiagios, Kirelos, 
Nimpiagios basilios, Nimpiagios Gregorios bithiologos, Nimpiagios Gregorios bithamatorogos, Nimpiagios Gregorios Armanios, nem bishom tishem et shmit et nafz oti chenike a, nem bishet eventi Konstantinopolis, nem bis nafshen ti Ephesus, nem niyot in vikeus binesti avantonios, nem bet mi ava pavili. Nem bishom tith oab ava meke eri nem nushiru tiru instavrofos nem binyot ava yo anis begomenos nem binyot ava bishoy bet mi biromin teleos. Be men read in Tibin Sutir and Arasos. Nem bin you tav above Liberim Tamu. Nem is a kill bif mathitis. Nem no choice in your teeth, O Abin Romeos, Maximus, Nem Dometius. Nem be me if sit him in. Bimartiros, Nihelo in Teshit, Nembigorith Oab, Nembigorith Oab of Amosinim Yohannes Kami, the Presbyteros, Nemnyot of Adanil Begomenos. Nem binyot ava isidorus biebris viterus. Nem binyot ava bachum fatikononia. Nem theodorus def mathitis. Nem binyot ava chinoti barshimene treatis. Nem ava vi. Bif mathitis Nem e poros ter Enten yeth o ab in taq Nay e te vol e ten Nu tu nem nem tuf Nay nan ti ro ef sob O o ma tu gon e thi e bekran e th o ab Et av moti em of eri ego. Nietos marota nera, nenten niote tho avem batrear en shies. Et avem kot em shois mam to no em sishitiro. O antef kene no avi. Those, O oh Lord, and everyone whose names we have mentioned, and those we have not mentioned, those whom each one of us has in mind, and those who are not in mind, who have fallen asleep and reposed in the faith of Christ, graciously accord, O oh Lord, to repose the soul of your servant, is Charon Rufanus. Let those first fathers and brethren have fallen asleep and repose in the faith of Christ since the beginning. Our holy fathers, the archbishops, our fathers, the bishops, our fathers, the hegumens, our fathers, the priests, our brethren, the deacons. Our fathers, the monks, and our fathers, the laymen, and for the full repose of Christians, that Christ our God may repose all their souls in paradise of joy, and we to accord mercy unto us and forgive us 
our sins. Lord, have mercy. Graciously, O Lord, repose all their souls in the bosom of our holy fathers, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Sustain them in green pasture beside still waters, in the paradise of joy, the place out of which grief, sorrow, and groaning have fled away in the light of your sins. Refold them in the paradise of joy, in the region of the living forever, in the heavenly Jerusalem, in that place. And we to our sojourners in this place, keep us in your faith and grant us your peace unto the end. As it was. Again, let us give thanks to God, the Pantocrator, the Father of our Lord God and Savior, Jesus Christ. For he also has made us worthy now to stand in this holy place, to lift up our hands and to serve his holy name. Let us also ask him to make us worthy of the communion and partaking of his divine and immortal mystery. Amen. 
ذاهلي باضي the precious blood and your precious blood of his Christ the Pantocrator the Lord our God Amen sin of the whole world is with us today on this table who is seated on the throne of his glory and before whom stand all the heavenly orders whom the angels praise with voices of blessing and before whom the archangels fall down and Corporeal living creatures sing the hymn of the Trisegion, and the twenty-four presbyters are seated on their thrones with twenty-four golden crowns upon their heads, and in their hands twenty-four golden balls full of incense, which are the prayers of the saints. They fall down before him who lives forever. Ah, 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 and the one hundred and forty four thousand the undefiled virgins praise the Lord saying holy 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 amen alleluia and we also worship the holy trinity praising him saying Holy is God the Father, the Pantocrator. Amen. Alleluia. Holy is His only begotten Son, Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Alleluia. Holy is the Holy Spirit, the Paraclete. Amen.
handful of glory is the holy Theotokos Saint Mary the Virgin Ami sacrifice which has been slain for the life of the whole world. Amen. Savior proclaimed, saying, My body is food indeed, and my blood is drink indeed. He who eats my body and drinks my blood dwells in me, and I in him. We ask you, O our Master, purify our souls, bodies, and spirits, so that with a pure heart, cleansed lips and enlightened soul and unashamed countenance, a faith unfaint, a pure conscience, a perfect patience and a firm hope. We may dare with boldness without fear to pray to you, O God, the Holy Father, who is in the heavens and say, our Father. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses as we give those who trespass against us. Please do not temptation, but deliver us the evil one. Christ is our Lord, with thine is the kingdom. Geen
ഈറിനെ പാസി Remember, O Lord, our assemblies bless them. Save the mean and with your spirit in the fear of God, let us attend. Amen, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. The whole is for the holy. Blessed be the Lord Jesus Christ, the Son of God. Sanctification is by the Holy Spirit. Amen. One is the all holy Father, one is the all holy Son, one is the all holy Spirit. Amen. Ah, 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 amen. Amen. the holy body and the precious through blood of Jesus Christ the son of our God Amen the holy precious body and the true blood of Jesus Christ the son of our God Amen The body and the blood of Emmanuel, our God, this is true. Amen. 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 I believe. I believe. I believe. I believe I believe I believe and confess to the last breath and confess to the last breath that this is the life giving gift flesh that this is the life giving flesh that your only begotten son that your only begotten son our lord god and savior jesus christ our lord god and savior jesus christ took from our lady took from our lady the lady of us all the lady of us all the holy theotokos saint mary the holy theotokos saint mary he made it one with his divinity he made it one with his divinity without mingling without mingling without confusion without confusion and without alteration and without alteration he confessed the good confession he confessed the, con- the good confession before pontius pilate before pontius pilate he gave it up for us he gave it up for us upon the holy wood of the cross upon the holy wood of the cross of his own will for us all of his own will for us all truly i believe truly i believe that his divinity parted not from his humanity that his divinity parted not from his humanity for a single moment nor a twinkling of an eye for a single moment nor a twinkling of an eye given for us for salvation given for us for salvation remission of sins remission of sins and eternal life to those who partake of him and eternal life to those who partake of him i believe i believe i believe i believe i believe i believe that this is true amen that this is true amen 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 i believe i believe i believe that this is true amen Pray for us and for all Christians who said to us concerning them remember us in the house of the Lord the peace and love of Jesus Christ be with you all let us sing alleluia pray for the worthy partaking of the immaculate and heavenly holy mysteries Lord have mercy
Atai Parthenosci تناولوش يتفضلوا قدام اللي لسه ما تناولوش يتفضلوا قدام حتى انا ما تناولش كله تناول كده طب يا منتظر ايه اطلعوا قدام اطلعوا قدام اتفضلوا ما تناولوش اطلعوا قدام اتفضلوا يا جماعه بسرعه اللي ما تناولوش اطلعوا قدام
Sacrifice, so it's flying into the highest to this hymn. Remember us before the Lord. Glory to God in the highest, peace, peace, on, earth, peace on earth, and goodwill towards men. Amen. Yes, sir. 
Christus Benoti, O King of Peace, grant us your peace, establish us your peace, forgive us our sins, for yours is the power, glory, blessing, and majesty forever. Amen. O Lord, make us worthy to pray thankfully. Our Father who art in heaven, on earth as it is in heaven, give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. In Christ Jesus our Lord, and thine is the kingdom of power. Now, love of God the Father, the grace of his only begotten Son, our Lord, God, and Savior Jesus Christ, communion, gift of the Holy Spirit, be with you all. Go in peace, may the peace of the Lord be with you all. Amen. Martina Klesia Sofia Fatal Fatusura Tal مبروك تفضلوا الشمامسة مفضلكم الايلز عشان الزفة الشمامسة تفضلوا صليب ابو اورو
أيها الأب نوى قدر هذه الدعوة التي استحققتها التي هي درجة القسيسية وتقليدك الأسرار العظيمة التي للعهد الجديد بدرجة التعليم فيجب عليك إذن أن تعمل وتعلم من جهة الأعمال الحسنة أفضل من الكلام أذكر كلام معلمنا بطرس الرسول القائل 
أن القصوص الذين فيكم أغبوا إليهم أن القص شريكهم والشاهد على آلام المسيح والشريك في المجد الذي يظهر أرعوا رعية الله التي فيكم وكونوا تفتقدوها لا بالظلم بل بإرادة قلب وليس كأنكم أرباب الأنصبة بل كونوا مثالا للرعية بل كونوا مثالا للرعية لكي إذا ظهر رئيس الرعاة تأخذون إكليل المجد غير المضمحل كن إذا عاملا بالوزن التي أؤتمنت عليها لتردها مضاعفة لتأخذ أجرة العبد الحكيم الأمين وتجمع الشعب على كلمة التعليم مثل مربية تربي بنيها لتخلص أنت والذين يسمعونك ادخل بسلام الرب معك دير هتكمل صوم شكل كده تفطر على صوم الع... على صوم الميلاد كده عارف سمناك نوح ليه او نوع في علاقه ما بين نوح والعذراء مريم اه سفينه بنقولها في زكسورجيت باكر انت فورت يا في زكسورجيت باكر بنقول ان اليمامة النقية او اليمامة الحسنة بشرت نوح بان الطوفان انتهى ويضار يخرج وبنقول العذراء وانت ايضا هي اليمامة النقية التي بشرتنا بسلام الله الذي قد صار للبشر فعلشان كده احنا هنا في صم العذراء كنيسة العذراء وزي ما نوح ارسل الحمامة اللي هي بترمز للعذراء وبشرت بالسلام فبرضو تبقى انت كده بتكرز بسلام الله الذي صار للبشر مبروك وربنا يبارك في خدمتك وفي كهنتك uh, we thank very very much uh, his uh, eminence metropolitan Yusuf for this great blessing that he gave us uh, we thank also our fathers the bishop bishop Matthias bishop Basil and bishop Gregory our fathers 
the priests who are with us, who came uh, especially from New Jersey and those who came also uh, from all the DFW churches. May God bless them all. God bless you all. Now we'll go to the social, the fellowship hall to get something together to celebrate the priesthood of our father, Abuna Noah. God bless. Yeah, I thought about it.